Hello, my friends, Liberty Garden. March 25th, Thursday, four days after I started this compost pile with 150 pounds of cow manure and um, grass clippings and shredded leaves. And today it's time for its first turning. So I'm going to turn it from that spot to this spot and then I'll go back to that spot back and forth and this will be I will probably turn it for about six times before the compost is ready I think that's more or less the Berkeley the Berkey method Berkeley method I think so it's a four days and then two turnings per week more or less maybe three and by the time by the time you get to the last turn, the compost is very, very ready to to be used. I might come back and add more more uh, leaves later, or more grass clippings. It should be a cubic yard. I don't think I have a cubic yard here, not even close to a cubic yard. It's more like three quarters of a, of a yard here. Uh, so I may, I may add more. And then, then the numbers are all messed up. But anyway, I'm going to turn it right now and uh let's see how hot it is watch it let's try it right now let's see how hot it is oh one more thing here this thing has 150 pounds of cow manure in here it's not a single fly on it no smell not fly and you can tell there's nothing because the dog's not digging into it so let's see how hot this is on the surface it feels warm not much though but one of the ones we're going here is this very oh yeah um but yeah i cannot even go any further because it's just so freaking hot my, the tip of my fingers are literally kind of burning up a little bit so hot it is in here so i'm just gonna cover it i'm gonna turn it so right now i think it's probably running it around without a thermometer it's kind of hard to tell but i'm guessing right now it's probably going Maybe 120 degrees in there, somewhere around that range. Don't know. By the way, I'll show you a little later the outcome. Here it is more or less at its core. And I don't know if you can see the steam coming out of this thing. You can barely see it, but there is some steam coming out of this thing. You see? This is freaking hot. There you see. I don't know if the phone catches the steam, but there's a little steam coming out of there. I can barely touch it. Oh, I touched a big turd. <laughs> there it is, a, steam, a pile of steaming cow manure. And now I know, hey, leave that alone, get out. This dog loves cow turd for some reason. And you can see the color of the leaves starting to turn, see? They're burning up already. You see this steaming right there? It is steaming, so this thing is hot. Okay, folks, I'll come back later. Okay, so I'm about 80% done turning the pile. And I've applied about 10 extra gallons of rainwater that I harvested last night in buckets. This is what I have left. Now, some uh, important things that you need to do when you're when you're raking up the 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 compost. When you get to the center, that's where all the big turds are, and they're they're gonna roll down. Okay, they're gonna roll roll down like that, big chunks. That's your heat elements. You want to bring them in. Just kind of bring them into the skirt of the pile. Be sure they're covered. That way they keep on burning inside the pile. You can tell up here. Oh, I can barely tell, but it's steaming a little bit right there. Anyway, so yeah, so every now and then, as as the big as the big uh, chunks of manure fall off the, and roll off like to the side, don't let them just sit there. You rake them in, bring them into the skirt of the of the compost pile for them to keep on working for you. And that's about it here. So, folks, I'm not going to bore you with any more of this. I hope you get the drift of it. I wish I had a, a cameraman, camera girl, or a tripod, but I don't have either. And uh, I'll finish this up right now. And this will be the first of six turnings that I will give the pile. And uh, basing, judging from how hot it is, which is very, very hot, it will, I think it should be ready in about probably about 20 21 24 days i guess uh, one more thing if the pile you find it to be a little dry just put a little more water on it you're not going to cool it off or anything it'll pick up steam again in no time 
water is actually good for it. But after the third or fourth turning, I don't think you need to put any more water on it. Just just uh, play by ear, I guess. But uh, you should be okay if you water it well the first time. I mean, this, this pile had about 100 gallons of water in it by the time I was done. So 150 in manure, well, 100 gallons of water in it by the time I, was, I, did, I made, it the, made it the first time. And there were, the rest was uh, uh, shredded leaves and, and grass. Okay, folks, until next time. Thanks for watching.